Hey guys, welcome back. In today's video, it's going to be very fun because tomorrow it is actually a national lipstick day. So to honor that, I have seven different shades of lipstick here from seven different brands. And not only that, these shades are apparently few people decided that these are the most popular shade per brand. So if you are curious, if you're excited, if you're interested, then let's get started with the first brand that I have here. First, I have the Clinique and this is their Black Honey Almost Lipstick. So if you are wondering why I do have this in packaging, it's just because I couldn't actually get the regular packaging that they have because it's always sold out and I got this from one of their gift food purchase. So let's open this up and show you a swatch first. So that is how the swatch of Black Honey. I do not have anything on my lips, it's just a lip moisturizer so there you have it apparently this shade is supposed to look good with everyone it is called almost lipstick so it doesn't feel like lipstick it's just very sheer and that is why Clinique Black Honey is very popular I will clean this one just take a look at one more time Next brand I have here is from Estee Lauder and for Estee Lauder, the most popular shade that they have, it's called Rebellious Rose and this one is so beautiful, it's sort of that satin finish, it has that nice rosy undertone. Let me put this on. already that is the shade it's definitely one of those shades that you can wear it almost every day and not like you know not too dark not too light and i like the texture of it very nice next brand will be from Giorgio armani and i have the lip maestro right here in the shade 501 now there's a lot of popular lipstick shade from Giorgio armani especially the number 400 but that is a red lipstick so i opt into this pink shade because i also have another red lipstick that's coming up this one is also really popular i'm gonna give you a swatch right now as you see it's very nice muted pink has that rosy undertone but it's slightly more on the purpley tone instead of like red and there you go really nice i like all of this lipstick take a look at one more time and then let's jump into the next shade next up will be from charlotte tilbury and i'm pretty sure you guys know about it already this one is the shade pillow talk my god everyone knows this like it's not a surprise but i'm gonna give you a swatch anyway and let's see so there you have it beautiful swatch and now i'm going to apply it on my lips So there you have it, a beautiful nude lipstick. It's not super pale, which is actually good for everyday. Like I said, this one is the most popular and you know, it's pillow talk. It's everyone's OG, everyone love it and I love it too. You can skip a lip liner with this, but if you want a little bit more dimension around the lips, you can apply a lip liner, but I don't need to. I like it this way. So take a look at one more time next one would be from mac but before i show you guys the shade i wanted to ask which do you think is the most popular lipstick from mac i had a hard time i didn't know what to put i have decided that this one is still the og velvet teddy and i really want to show you guys a very classic nude lipstick from mac and this is definitely one of the best and one of the, like most love that people just keep coming back people keep repurchasing it let me apply it for you guys let's see there you go it's beautiful i mean why <laughs> now for the next brand and their shade if I had a hard time with MAC, 
this brand definitely has a lot and I did have a hard time maybe 10 times 10 times harder to decide but I came to the conclusion that this is probably the most popular shade and also suitable for everybody and this one is from NARS again and in the shade American woman so it's in power matte liquid and I'm gonna give you a swatch of this as well look at that it's just really pigmented and this formula it lasts you longer it's liquid matte and now I'm going to give you some application So there you have it guys, the shade American Woman. It's definitely one of those shades that you should have. It's so perfect. I love it. Like, oh my God. Beautiful shade. Take a look at one more time. All right, are you guys ready for the last shade that I have here? And of course, lipstick is not complete without the red color. And for the brand, I chose the Dior and this is the popular shade in 999 matte finish. I'm going to give you a swatch for this one. Look at that pigmentation. It definitely deserves to be so popular and it just looks good with everybody. And now I'm gonna give you a swatch or a demo rather and see how this looks. What do you guys think? It's definitely classic. It's definitely elegant. It's comfortable. It's nice. It's pigmented. It coats really well. And that's why it really deserves to be popular. So there you have it. And I think that's it for me today, guys. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoy as much as I did because it was really hard for me to decide which shade I should go for um, per brand, but it definitely feeling good and feeling happy with my decision. And I hope you enjoy as well. If you like the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. Please click the notification bell so that you are updated whenever I have my next video. Thank you again for watching and I will see you on my next one. Bye guys!